Hello my dear students, today we are going to learn about group 15 oxides. All these elements react with oxygen and to form two types of oxides E2O3 and E2O5 where E is nitrogen, phosphorus, arsenic, antimony or bismuth. P pi P pi bonding tendency with oxygen is very high in nitrogen. This is the reason why nitrogen forms a variety of oxides. Nitrogen forms 5 stable oxides. Due to the inert pair effect, bismuth is not able to form oxides in plus 5 oxidation state. The table shows that different types of oxides of group 15 and their oxidation state. The oxide in the higher oxidation state of the element is more acidic than that of lower oxidation state. Their acidic character decreases down the group. The acidic strength of oxide of nitrogen increases from N2O3 to N2O5. As we move down the group, the acidic character diminishes. As such, the basic character of oxide increases on moving down the group. For example, the oxides of the type E2O3 of nitrogen and phosphorus are purely acidic. Those of arsenic and antimony are amphoteric and those of bismuth predominantly basic. The plus 5 oxides are found in each case to be more acidic than the corresponding plus 3 oxides. Now we can discuss about the structure of different oxides in detail. Firstly, dinitrogen monoxide or nitrous oxide or N2O. Nitrous oxide is also known as laughing gas. It is commonly used as an anesthetic. It has three resonance structures out of which one is a major contributor and one is a minor contributor. Structure 1 is most stable since oxygen is more electronegative than nitrogen. The negative charge will be stabilized better by the oxygen atom. The structure 3 will be a minor contributor because it has a greater separation of charge compared with the other two. Moreover, it shows a positive charge placed on the more electronegative oxygen atom and a very destabilizing minus 2 formal charge on a nitrogen atom. Dinitrogen monoxide is a linear molecule. Nitrogen nitrogen bond length is 113 picometer. Nitrogen oxygen bond length is 119 picometer. Another nitrogen oxide is nitrogen monoxide or nitric oxide. The chemical formula is NO. Nitrogen monoxide consists of total of 15 electrons. This is an odd electron molecule. In the gaseous state, it is paramagnetic. The NO bond length is 115 picometer. We know in the gaseous state, nitric oxide is paramagnetic. But in the liquid and the solid state, it is diamagnetic and exists as lose dimers and are formed cancelling out the magnetic moment of the unpaired electrons. Another nitrogen oxide is nitrogen dioxide. The chemical formula is NO2. Nitrogen dioxide having 23 electrons and is an odd electron molecule. In the gaseous state it is paramagnetic. Nitrogen dioxide molecule is angular by ONO bond angle is 134 degree. The ON bond length is 120 picometer that is intermediate between the single and the double bond. The odd electron exists on the nitrogen atom. Another nitrogen oxide is dinitrogen tetroxide and its chemical formula is N2O4. On cooling Nitrogen dioxide, the gas condenses to a brown liquid and ultimately to a colorless solid, both of which are diamagnetic because of dimerization. The dimer has been illustrated to encompass a planar structure. The nitrogen nitrogen bond length is extremely large, 175 picometer, and making this is an extremely weak bond. Another nitrogen oxide is dinitrogen trioxide. The chemical formula is N2O3. It has an unusually long nitrogen nitrogen bond length, which is equal to 186 picometer. The N2O3 molecule is planar. 
the bond length and bond angles are shown in the figure another nitrogen oxide is dinitrogen pentoxide and it is chemical formula is n2o5 it is an anhydride of nitric acid which is acidic in nature it has a planar structure it is a resonance hybrid of the two forms in the molecule dinitrogen pentoxide nitrogen oxygen nitrogen bond angle is 112 degree oxygen nitrogen oxygen bond angle is 134 degree nitrogen oxygen single bond length is 151 picometer nitrogen oxygen double bond length is 119 picometer the next we can discuss about phosphorus oxides phosphorus forms several oxides two common oxides are phosphorus 3 oxide or tetraphosphorus hexoxide p4o6 and phosphorus 5 oxide or tetraphosphorus decaoxides p4o10 both oxides have a structure based on the tetrahedral structure of elemental white phosphorus firstly phosphorus 3 oxide or p4o6 here all the phosphorus atoms are in the plus 3 oxidation state the p op bond angle is 127 degree opo bond angle is 99.5 degree po bond length is 166 picometer it is a colorless volatile solid with melting point 24 degree celsius and boiling point 174 degree celsius here all the phosphorus oxygen bonds are of equal length another phosphorus oxide is p4o7 it is a mixed p3 p5 oxide terminal oxo group bearing phosphorus atoms are in the p5 state other phosphorus atoms are in the p3 state in the case of p4o7 there is only one terminal oxo group bearing phosphorus atom another phosphorus oxide is p4o8 it is a mixed p3 p5 oxides the terminal oxo group bearing phosphorus atoms are in the p5 state other phosphorus atoms are in the p3 state here there are two terminal oxo group bearing phosphorus atoms another phosphorus oxide is p4o9 it is a mixed p3 p5 oxide the terminal oxo group bearing phosphorus atoms are in the p5 state other phosphorus atoms are in the p3 state here there are three terminal oxo group bearing phosphorus atoms another phosphorus oxide is p4o10 phosphorus 5 oxide here all the phosphorus atoms are in the p5 state pop bond angle is 123 degree opo bond angle is 102 degree PO bridge bond length is 160 picometer PO terminal bond length is 143 picometer here there are four terminal oxo group bearing phosphorus atoms today we have discussed about nitrogen oxides and phosphorus oxides their structure bond length bond angle etc in the next session we will discuss about the oxo acids of group 15 elements thank you